Hello lovelies, this is me, Latte, back again, doing a little bit of an update. It's been a while since I did an update because it's hard for me to film at home. There's not really a space for me to film at home, so I'm trying, so as you see, I'm back at work. I'm at work, I'm waiting for the water to fill up, so I figured I'd do a quick video. Um, let's get that out of the way. <laughs> um, I was like, I don't think you guys want to see that basket. Anyways. So, um, this is going to be my five-month update. Since my vertical sleeve gastrectomy, I was sleeved on April, um, April 18th with uh, Eviva um, by Dr. Harris. And my starting weight was, um, I'm trying to, oh. Uh, my start, my he, my highest weight was 398 in January of this year. Um, my starting weight, my surgery weight, the day of surgery, I was 366, and right now I'm at 305.8. Um, I went down to low as 301.2, and I could just keep like staying around that. So which prompted me to now I have to, sorry. Now I need to pick it up a notch. So I had this weight, this past weight was on the 22nd. Today is now the 25th when I'm recording this. So I haven't weighed since then. The So the 305.8 is from that date. Therefore, um, I may have gone down some, I don't know, but I'm on my cycle right now. So I probably am just like holding water weight. Water weight. <laughs> um, I, so what I'm trying to say is I, have been I think I hit my first plateau and so with that being said I decided that I need to kick it up a, a notch and I joined a gym and I've been going pretty much every day so I joined the gym last Tuesday and I've been going every day and um really monitoring making sure I get my protein intake and trying and um making sure that I'm just eating a lot better um and I'm trying to do that as much as possible it's hard it's not easy at all um, but yeah, I've been trying to also make sure that I'm getting my steps up. I've been trying to get it so that I average around 10,000 a day. Um, and this last week or so I have been averaging around 9,000. So I'm getting up there some days, uh, 10,000, some days a little less. So it's been more around 9,000 for the past week. Um, physically, I feel great. I have, I don't have many issues physically. Not, as, I haven't had any acid reflux reflux problems um so or anything to that nature um i think mostly right now is like emotional things like mental things are kind of getting to me more so and um what i mean by that is i don't know if because of this 90 some odd pound weight change if that has change the way my birth control affects me and what I mean by that is like before my hormones were out of whack like when I ha when I was up to near 400 pounds my hormones were really crazy so I wasn't getting a menstrual and so I think my birth control kind of brought it into level and I didn't have any side effects from birth control any like emotional side effects or any physical really side effects except for the fact oh, I just didn't get a period until um, the week before it was time for me to get my next uh, depo shop but um, this time since I've been losing weight I found myself to be really irritable and just like upset and and there's a lot of things like going on like I don't see this is like, like there's a lot of changes in my life like right after I got my the surgery I you know moved in with my partner and that's all new and then this body thing is new like changing of my body and changing my lifestyle style is new so it's like I don't know what all is affecting what and it's it's just weird so I'm contemplating 
not getting the shot again in October when it's due just to hopes that that will make me sane but I don't know that's just where my brain is right now I find myself um like you know now like I've already lost 90 pounds so obviously I'm having some like loose skin and things and it's not even you know it's just that like squishy kind of loose skin and so I'm just dealing with what I see in the mirror I don't regret my sleeve at all I I love it and I I tried as hard as I could to prepare myself for the whole loose skin thing and try to not be hard on myself and try to like keep my confidence you know because I've always kind of like tried to um, well felt myself to be a confident person but it's just you know it's just a lot of change and I'm not gonna be like I'm not gonna bullshit you guys I'm gonna be honest because you guys are watching this because you have questions about it yourself so I'm just kind of like documenting my own stuff um, I'm frustrated that I haven't lost any more weight like I've kind of been at a plateau for like two and a half weeks or so but I have just I just now like started working out again working out like really working out and so I've been going to some Zumba classes and on days that I can't go to any like Zumba classes I was going to um I was just going to the gym and doing um, treadmill and elliptical and some machines that my fitness instructor told me to do and um, she gave me like a workout um, sheet and had like reps to do and all that pajage and um, so I'm just trying to push through that um, I don't know it's, it's just really tough for me right now like psychologically dealing with all this and I don't have an appointment again with my um, people until October because it's like you go every month and then after the fourth month you go you don't you go you skip two months and then come back for your sixth month and um, it's probably the hardest because when I see them every month it like really helps me like center back in but I think it makes sense because at the end of the day they're not going to be there every single day I mean like this pro the program is for two years like you you know but like it kind of has to like wean you off so you're like on your own and independent and everything um, one thing if anyone has any like some apps that have helped me um, plant nanny helps me make sure I get water in it'll like yell at you like hey like you have a plant let's show you you have a plant and when you drink water you it waters the plant and the plant grows so throughout the day like if you go a while without having pressed the button saying that you drink water it'll say hey plant uh, your plant is thirsty and maybe you are too and then so you can water your plants and that helps me a lot because sometimes like I don't you get so busy and you run around and you forget and um, you have to remember to put your health first um, I am down to like 1x and like extra large and like large I'm like wearing things in that realm whereas before I was wearing like 3x's and 4x's so that's pretty awesome um I can show you guys some body shots so this shirt isn't the best it's a uh, a-line dress so but this is me five months out And I'm just wearing like yoga pants and some boots today. So <laughs> I don't know. This is five months. I've noticed a lot of this going down, like in my face and things. I feel like most of my heaviness is like down, like below my belly button, like my belly button and down, like. Yeah. 
it's just the mind catching up to the body like this is you this is you and it's gonna be okay Um, I don't really have much else to say. If you guys want to follow my Snapchat, my Instagram, um, I put stuff about my workouts there and um, meals that I make that are, you know, trying to stay. I just actually flung my hair ties all the way across there. Anyways, meals that I um, have that I'm trying to, like, stay healthy high protein, low carb meals and things of that nature. So yeah, um, as always, keep smiling.